everybody, Mama Malich here. Um, I know I haven't checked in with you guys in a while. Um, so I'm like, let's just chat. Um, nothing much has been going on. Um, I've been doing just a lot of kind of um, Illinois, Indiana runs, uh, Kentucky, um, Missouri, Ohio runs. Um, everything's still been going good. Um, just trying to find out why it seems like for the past few weeks that um, I haven't been able to make it home. You know, I've been running out of drive time that on my Fridays I haven't been able to make it home. For instance, um, last Friday uh, I only made it to the drop-off spot, which was St. Charles, Illinois, and then Fabe and the kids had to come and get me, and that was like an hour and 30 minutes away from my home. And that's when I realized, like, wow, for the past few weeks, I've only been making it like an hour and a half from the house. So, talk to my driver leader, see is it something I'm doing, or you know, is that just how things have been? I don't know. Because I thought when they say home, they get you as close as they can. So, you know, you other truck drivers, if you can give me some info or shed some light on that, you know, I'm, I'm all ears. Um, today I'm in, where am I, North Vernon, Illinois. I made it here uh, last night around 2.45, you know, um, I went to pick up my load from, um, what was that, Romeoville, Illinois? No, West Chicago, Illinois, and I brought it here, so I picked it up, dropped it off, had about three hours left on my drive time clock, good. You know, um, I parked in their cab lot, slept, and now I'm about to uh, pick up an empty, and I'm going to uh, Mount Vernon, Indiana, which is three hours from where I'm at, and I'm going to take that load to Monroe, Ohio. It's um, 80 degrees. Um, it was, was very cool last night, so I actually slept with um, the truck off. But, you know, I woke up and it was so hot. I woke up and I'm like, why it seems like I'm sweating? Um, so, um, yeah, I woke up to it being 80 degrees. Um, other than that, you know, I just been chilling. You know, you see, I see if you have, if you're on my Facebook, what I do on my off days. I would have really been having some fun. But um, I'm also starting to... Uh, try a little diet while I'm in a truck so the truck won't take over. You now I got a little pudge I'm trying to get under control. And um, I started yesterday, so um, I ate um, like a little bitty small bowl of chili and a few crackers um, for breakfast. And um, when I was in the truck waiting on to be loaded, it took them about three hours to load me, I ate a salad and my body was like, what's going on where's the rest <laughs> you know like okay that was the appetizer where's the entree where's the dessert you know where is the snacks so i tried to uh you know drink water after everything i ate um uh eat, eat a peach eat a mandarin and my body was still like if you don't give me some food some meatloaf mashed potatoes gravy you know, so I'm like, that's going to be a struggle, but I feel like as long as I started, you know, that, that, that's a good thing, as long as I started, so just pray for me <laughs> in that department, you know, but, um, overall, I've been doing good, I'm still, um, chilling, you know, still enjoying this experience, um, I'm going to try to video more often, you know, just been, just busy, you know, not really much I felt like needed to be recorded, but, um, yeah, just stay tuned and you know guys I share uh, my experience with you and if you have any questions just hit me up be safe